Hey, what's up gamers? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving into AMD Software Adrenaline Edition 24.9. Want to uncover the best settings for gaming? Whether you're trying to hit those high FPS numbers or just looking for smooth, stutter-free gameplay, I've got you covered. Let's maximize your AMD GPU performance and get you gaming at the highest level. Let's jump right into it. First up, we're going to start with general settings. These are your baseline tweaks and they can make a real difference right away. Radian Anti-Lag. This one's key for fast-paced games, especially shooters like CS or Valorant. Radian Anti-Lag reduces the time between your input and the action on screen. This gives you more responsive gameplay. If you're competitive, turn it on, trust me, it's a game changer. Radian Boost. Want better performance without sacrificing too much visual quality? Enable Radian Boost. When you're moving fast in a game, it lowers the resolution slightly to keep those frames high. You'll notice a performance improvement in games like Apex Legends. Radian Image Sharpening Lastly, in general settings, we have Radian Image Sharpening. Set this to 70 to 80% for a balance between sharp visuals and performance. Your games will look crisp without taxing your GPU too much. Radian Super Resolution RSR if you're playing at a lower resolution to save FPS, Radeon Super Resolution RSI can upscale your game for a better look. This is useful if you're running a mid-range GPU but still want decent visuals. Definitely turn this on if you're trying to squeeze out some extra frames without sacrificing quality. Anti-aliasing. Next, let's talk about anti-aliasing. If you leave it on application settings, the game controls how it handles jagged edges. But if you want smoother visuals, set it to enhanced within adrenaline to get cleaner edges. This can make a noticeable difference in games like The Witcher. Texture filtering quality. For those looking for a performance boost, set texture filtering quality to performance. If you've got a decent GPU and want sharper textures, standard is the middle ground. This setting won't tank your FPS, but you'll get better texture clarity. Tessellation mode. Now, for tessellation mode, we're going to override the application settings and set this to 8x or lower. Like for X, tessellation improves the detail of 3D models, but lowering it helps with performance. If you're playing open world games with a lot of terrain like Assassin's Creed Valhalla, you'll want to keep this lower to avoid FPS drops. Finally, let's move over to the performance tab where we can fine tune and even overclock your GPU if you want to push it to its limits. Tuning control overclocking. If you're comfortable with it, head over to tuning control and set it to manual. A small GPU overclock like increasing the core clock by 100 MHz can give you a noticeable FPS boost. Just make sure to monitor temperatures while you're gaming. Fan tuning. Keep your GPU cool by enabling fan tuning. Adjust the fan curves so the fans kick in earlier when temperatures start rising. This will help avoid throttling and maintain smooth performance during long gaming sessions. Undervolting, if you want to reduce heat and power consumption, try undervolting your GPU, lowering the voltage can help keep your system cooler, but make sure to do this gradually and test it with benchmarks to ensure stability. And that's it, those are the best settings for AMD Software Adrenaline Edition 24.9. Want to get the most out of your GPU, whether you're after maximum FPS or want a balance of performance and visuals, these settings should give you a smoother, more responsive gaming experience. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more gaming optimization tips. Let me know in the comments if you try out these settings or if you've got any tweaks of your own to share. Catch you in the next one, gamers.